Hello, it is a Vlogmas Day 10, and it snowed, so there is snow on the ground, <laughs> and I was up early going to the stores, getting a few things. I, I mean, this really wasn't my trip. I was really just tagging along, so we were looking for Alani new energy drinks, and so I just took the time to go through all the aisles and just kind of show you what we got. <laughs> um, I saw that The Rock has an energy drink, which I think I knew this, but... I just haven't seen it in stores and there it is okay wonderful and then we went and looked at some more of the Alani news um, I actually do like Alani news they're pretty delicious and I've tasted some very nasty energy drinks we went walked around the aisles looked at the ice cream looked at some of the other foods went through the chips because you know you always want to get some chips um, <laughs> my roommate was getting some other stuff and yeah, so we're just like looking around. I'm helping getting some of the groceries that she was picking up. Trying to be good because I was not here to buy food. So <laughs> I was trying to stay very, very focused and such. But it's so tempting. There's so many interesting things all the time. And iced tea is also on a cereal box, which I didn't know that either. So yeah, I don't eat Cheerios, so that's probably why. Um, I went and I looked at the magazines and books and of course, I happened upon two BTS books. Oh my gosh, I realized that there's three there. How did I not see the other one? Oh my gosh. Well, anyways, BTS is everywhere. I can't escape them and I kind of love it. I'm going to be so sad when they started listing, but you know, whatever. Uh, I looked at the book selection. It wasn't exactly anything that I personally was interested in. I mean, there were some titles that maybe, but uh, nothing that really appealed so that was a bust <laughs> but they had quite a few books I, I was I was shocked it was it was a good selection it's just nothing that really I was interested in and then I lost my roommate so I had to go find her <laughs> and it took me a while but then we made it to the checkout and then we made it to Target. And this was very dangerous, but I am very proud of myself. I stayed focused. I have been looking for disco balls everywhere, but they are nowhere to be found. I remember people said that they were at five below, but all the five belows near me don't have them. And every single time I go, I am so disappointed. But I really want a disco ball in my room to hang up. But I wanted ones that were bigger than the ones they had at Target. And I also saw that Target has like a better selection of desk calendars, which like where were those when I was looking for them? They also have these mini trees. If you saw my day one, you saw that I had mini trees on my one of my shelves. And because I have those and I even have some that I didn't put up, I don't need any more. But that green one that I showed you was actually really cute. So yes, I saw this pink jacket and I kind of want it, but I had to stay strong. And I also like this jacket. But I have to stay strong, have to stay focused, can't can't get distracted. But they had Into the Spider-Verse socks. Mm, it's tempting. Um, <laughs> I walked around some more looking at all of the clothing, all of the clothing options. And, you know, saw some gingerbread houses that were already put together. So all you would have to do is decorate them. And I think that's absolute genius because gingerbread houses, oh my gosh. That also reminded me that I have a gingerbread house. That I never did. So maybe I'll do that during Vlogmas one day. I went and looked at some of the graphic tees in the guy section because, you know, they have the best selection of shirts. If you didn't know, you need to go and check it out next time. And saw a few shirts that are actually really nice. This Avatar one, I, I was just like, why? Okay. Um, <laughs> this Powerpuff Girls villains shirt, excellent. I might need to go back and get that. Um, then I saw these pajama pants. And I don't know why I was looking at them, but I got thoroughly distracted and then I saw some Black Panther ones and I was tempted to get them. But I don't really, I don't know. Some of the books, yes. Some of the kids books, I don't know why we were over there actually. But we were over there for a second. I always see people on TikTok doing these unsolved file mysteries and I kind of really want to do one. So I'm putting that on my list. We looked at some of the other games. I don't really play games, to be quite honest. Um, never really did. But I do like to look 
and see what's going on in the game world for people who like games. I saw this book. It's always recommended to me by people, and so maybe one day I'll read it. And then I saw this one, and I thought that the cover was interesting, but I haven't heard much about it. But it's only got one copy, so I mean, hello. Um, they restocked the Midnight Vinyls, which is great. <laughs> and then I went to look at the albums and check out like the K-pop selection, <laughs> and um, it's pretty good. They had the Astronaut by Jin Nayeon's album and also itsy's album very great to see all in stock uh i made it back over to the pajamas apparently i don't know i was all over the store definitely getting my steps in saw a lot of cute pajama sets yes and i think i went to a few other stores but now we are back at the house and i had some mail which is also some k-pop albums which is why i really wasn't buying k-pop albums when I was at Target because I already had some waiting for me. And this one is Red Velvet's most recent release. It's called Birthday. And I loved this album totally. Like, it, it was so good. B-sides were excellent. And honestly, I haven't been enjoying many of the more recent Red Velvet releases, which is really disappointing me because they are B-side queens. Like, I adore their music. Like, I collect for them specifically for Sulgi but um so it was kind of heartbreaking for me when I wasn't really enjoying a lot of the releases that they were putting out recently but this album restored my faith completely I have been obsessed unable to stop listening to everything and I am just like so in love with it I think it's probably my next favorite after Really Bad Boy because the b-sides on Really Bad Boy were just excellent if you have not listened to it, you need to go and listen to it. I think Bye Bye is my favorite. Yes, I also really loved the concepts for this, but I really hope we can get out of the Reve Festival soon. Free them from that festival. It's over. It's done. It's played out. They need to come up with something else. Um, I got Irene's photo card and then I got Solgi's Polaroid, which I was super geeked about because I as I said, collect Sulgi. So yes. And then I had both versions of Jin's the Astronaut. Now this one was kind of frustrating because I wanted to be able to do it the same way. If you didn't know, before I started this channel, I used to have a K-pop unboxing channel, which I tried to morph into a normal, like kind of what I do here on this channel. Um, <laughs> type of channel but as you can see I'm annoyed because I can't get the photo book to open all the way and I don't really want to crack it and like risk the photo book like falling out so yeah if I had my normal unboxing setup I could properly show you the photo book but I I was just doing with what I have and I just wanted to hold it up and yeah sorry it came with two stickers and I thought that they both were very very cute because one is Jin and one is his little character that he made. And then these are the lyrics. Very beautiful. Love this song. It's so good. The music video is beautiful. The message of the song is beautiful. The postcard is beautiful. The photo cards are beautiful. Just stunning. That's the actual photo card. And then this is version two of the album. And once again, stunning album poster i don't know i feel like i'm all over the place with this voiceover i am not good at voiceovers or maybe the chaoticness of the voiceover is what will be appealing for it i don't know but either way what was i talking about oh the message of the song was absolutely beautiful and stunning i am going to miss jen so much while he's enlisted but i know that all the members are going inevitably and so yeah the time has come and this was such a special gift from him to us and I'm glad that he was able to do this single and you know not pressure himself to do like a full mini album or a full album or anything like that like just doing the single for now is great and it was just really beautiful and now all of his songs are on Spotify so we can listen to them all the time while he's away and hold down the fort it's gonna be amazing we're gonna have a great time and there's so much content that I need to catch up on with BTS but knowing that they're going to be on hiatus very very soon probably all of them um i can catch up on all the content then because i will have plenty of time this is the other postcard that's pre-ordered benefit and that is the other photo card which he looks amazing and those are all the albums i unboxed i hope that you enjoyed vlogmas day 10 ah!